perfume. I can't breathe. Excuse me. Out of respect for the rest of the class, I suggest spraying less perfume. But, Miss Applewood, I need to spray a lot to cover up your stench. Wow, that's a lot. Mm-hmm. My mommy buys me a new one every week. Oh, can I have some? No, get your own. But I thought your mom buys you a new one every week. Yeah, and I use an entire one every single week. That's not very nice. Remember, Brianna, sharing is caring. You know what else is caring, Miss Applewood? Self-care. You should try it sometime. And maybe some wrinkle cream. Brianna, what is that now? It's lip plumper. Okay, we'll put it away. This is a classroom, not a beauty salon. Okay, and just because it's a classroom, that doesn't change the fact that I need plump lips. You're disrupting the class. <gasps> Why is it burning? Uh, oh, wow, that lip bumper really works. Look at her. She's so hideous. She's never going to get any money. It must be so embarrassing to show your face at the school. <laughs> she's in debt because she's so hideous. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, stop. <laughs> Mom, everyone at school was making fun of me again. As they should. You're a disgrace to this family. Everyone in this family is known to be rich because of their beauty, except for you. Come with me. It's time you learned how to cover up. Cover up what, Mom? Your face. I'll show you how to do your makeup. <sighs> Much better. Look in the mirror. Do you like it? Yeah, I do like it, Mom. From now on, never take this makeup off. And constantly reapply it throughout the day, understand? Okay. Whoa, who's that new girl? She's so pretty. She's getting so much money. I wish I was like gorgeous. Hello, Brianna. I'm Dr. Kim. Hello? I would like to help you enhance your beauty. What do you mean? I can perform surgery on you and make you beautiful. Sweetie, have you started dating anyone yet? You're going to have to date someone if you want to be married one day. No, how am I supposed to date someone when I can't even see them? You're unable to see all men so that you can focus on their personality. Looks don't matter. Yes, they do. You've never seen a man before. What do you think makes a man attractive? Well, he needs to be tall, tan, have brown eyes, and have a very big heart. Well, sweetie, one day you're going to learn that what's on the surface doesn't matter. How you truly fall for someone and connect with someone is their personality and how they are on the inside. Yeah, 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 okay. Whatever you say, Mom. Oh, hello. Whoa, who's talking to me? Ah, it's just me. It's Timmy. Oh, hi, Timmy. Brianna, I was thinking we should get to know each other better. Want to go on a date? I'm not sure, Timmy. I think I should ask a couple questions first before we go on a date. Even though I can't see you, how tall are you? Huh? Did you say something? I said, how tall are you? I can't hear you! Sweetie, you have a symbol on your face. Oh, a chocolate ice cream. Sweetie, you have to find someone with the same symbol as you. How much time do you have? I got 60 seconds. If you don't find your matching symbol in 60 seconds, you'll be eliminated. Ah! Sweetie, did you get any hints? I got a hint. The person who has your matching symbol is really, really, really old. Mommy, where's your symbol? We probably match. I'm not really, really old. I don't have a symbol. Yes, you are. You're like 100 years old. No, I'm not. Sweetie, think who is even older than Mommy? Who? <gasps> Grandma! 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 Do you have a chocolate ice cream on your face? No, I have a pizza. You do? Mommy, Grandma and I have the same symbol. What do I do now? You need to touch Grandma. Okay. Grandma, give me your hand. No. Grandma. No, don't touch me. Grandma. You have Grandma. cooties. No. Sweetie, would you like your gift now? Yes, give me my gift. Here you go. I think you're going to love it. A paintbrush. Thanks. Look in the back, honey bun. There's also paints. Mm-hmm. Now, don't give me that face. It's not just any paintbrush. It's a magic paintbrush. It really is magic. That paintbrush is very special. Yeah, yeah, sure it is. Of course, Grandma. Mm-hmm. Morning, Mommy. Grandma's gone. She left Earth. Ah! Why don't you go draw a picture of Grandma with the paintbrush she gave you in memory of her? Grandma just left us, and you want me to picture her in my mind and paint it? Okay, I'll do it. I'm done painting Grandma, Mommy. Look, I even got her a mustache. Sweetie, Grandma didn't have a mustache. Grandma? What's up, everybody? It's Jake. Now get ready with me. You know, I'm not like other guys. I actually wash my face. Wanna make... I also...
also brush my teeth just for the video though what men can wear makeup too it's still manly yeah i got a little feminine side to me <coughs> cologne <laughs> i'm sorry i'm just a little emotional right now i was just thinking about women's hardships you know just because i'm six five manly super buff that doesn't mean that women's hardships don't hurt me so bad Ugh! i could just cry <laughs> Y'all, I think that I found my soulmate. He's 560 to 590 years. You guys know I like them older. Maybe it's Timmy. <laughs> okay, is it rolling? Hi, girls. So your boyfriend was saying you wanted a picture to see if there was going to be any girls he was hanging out with. So I asked him to take a video because I just want to assure you, you know, we're both girls. We know what it's like that there's nothing. There's nothing going on here at all. <laughs> Stop. Stop. <laughs> Stop. Anyways, there's nothing. We've been friends for a long time. <laughs> And you have absolutely nothing to worry about. It's so weird that VIP thinks they're so way too cool to do this. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, 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 meow. people play with this yeah <laughs> you're stinky Ew. no no guys i'm not stinky i showered this morning you are stinky and smelly and weird ouch my heart oh no brianna come with me immediately <gasps> miss teacher why does my heart hurt because somebody hurt you whenever someone says or does something that's hurtful to you you'll lose a percentage of your heart that's why when people are being hurtful towards you, you must leave immediately so it doesn't damage your heart. The damage on your heart depends on how badly it hurts you. And if you lose all your heart's percentage, you'll die. <gasps> babe! Babe, hey! Oh! Babe, are you okay? You fell pretty hard. Yeah, I'm okay, babe. Anyways, I should get to class. All right, be careful. <laughs> that video of Brianna was so funny. I know! What video? You look so silly! Guys, what video? It's someone I know. I can take you to him. Do you know him personally? What's his name? Are you guys friends? I guess you could say that. Brianna, who? Shh. Not right now, Sophie. I can take you to him, but not right now. Meet me outside the school at 10 p.m. and make sure that nobody sees you. 10 p.m.? But that will only give me two hours to find my soulmate. Do you trust me or not? I don't trust you. I don't even know you, but you're my only hope, so I guess I have to. Great. I'll see you later. You ready to go? Yeah. Here, take my hand. You really know where my soulmate is? I do. Don't worry. I'll bring you to him. Why'd you take me to a graveyard? Look at the gravestone in front of you. R.I.P. Jimmy? Who's Jimmy? Is that supposed to be my soulmate? It is. That's me. I'm Jimmy. Look. Your symbol. It's the same as mine. Because I'm your soulmate. Wait. But if you're Jimmy, then why does it say on this gravestone that you're dead? Jimmy, your forehead, it says... Hard! Timmy, you might be my soulmate. Our words match perfectly! Ah! Timmy? What's wrong with him? Why did he run away? I don't know. He's your soulmate. Timmy! Timmy! Timmy, why are you running from me? We might be soulmates. I'm scared of girls. Well, man up then, Timmy! I'm also scared of love. I don't want to be heartbroken. We're going to bonk heads and see if we're soulmates, okay? Okay. Ready? Oh! Timmy, your word is gone. So is yours. That means we're soulmates. Yes! Timmy, why don't you look happy? Because the word represents how our relationship will be. We're going to be heartbroken. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Ha <laughs> ha, you guys are going to have a bad relationship. You're going to be heartbroken. Be quiet, Attention, everyone. Listen up. 
God, is that you? There's been a misunderstanding on what the soulmate word represents. What the soulmate word really represents is... Mommy, what is this word on my forehead? It won't come off. Sweetie, that's your soulmate word. Soulmate word? Yes, but the word's not finished yet. Only your soulmate will have the other half of the word. If you think someone has the other half of your word, you can press your heads together. And if your word disappears, that means they're your soulmate. But the word you and your soulmate makes also has meaning. In your case, that isn't very good. Why, Mommy? Because the word represents how your relationship with your soulmate will be. The other half of your word might be heart, which means you'll be heartbroken. <gasps> Look, everyone. Brianna's forehead says broken. That means she's going to have a bad relationship with her own soulmate. You guys don't know that for sure. The other half of my word could be something good. I don't know how the word broken could ever be good. I already met my soulmate. Our word is lovely. Aww. Hey, Brianna, I saw someone today that had heart written on their forehead. Maybe they're your soulmate. It would match your word perfectly. Who? Who is it, Eugene? Show me now. First, you need to do something for me. Mommy, there's something in my nose. <gasps> A letter. That's not just any letter. That's your soulmate letter. Oh. What? It's a letter from your soulmate's name. Above your head, you can see how many letters there are in your soulmate's name. You must find all your soulmate letters, and you'll even be given hints on where to find them. Once you complete the name, you'll meet your soulmate. How many letters does your soulmate have? My soulmate has like 11 letters in his name. That's not good, sweetie. That means it'll be hard for you to find your soulmate. No! Mmm, chips. Brianna, don't eat that. You got an L. Yeah, I took an L for sure, Sophie. I don't have any chips in this bag. You found one of your soulmate letters. That's way better than chips. I'm so close to finding my soulmate. I only need two more letters. How many more letters do you need, Brianna? I need nine more letters. Dang, that's going to be hard to find all those letters. What's this? I think you just got a hint. What does it say? Damn! Ha! So look at him. Check the flavor of the rhythm I wrote. And while I get a chance here, let me clear my throat. He needs help. Why didn't he tell me sooner? You don't know. Maybe he was trying to. Come on, hurry up. I need to fill in the blank. I need to talk to him. I'm scared. He's scared, Sophie. <laughs> oh, I gotta fill in the blank. Um, I'll say, where are you? Dang it, there's not enough spaces. Okay, where, then letter R, then letter U. Brianna, you know you can blink, right? I don't want to miss a notification! Ah. Did he say something? Yes, he said, I don't know. That's very, very helpful, soulmate. Ha! I got another fill in the blank. I should say something like, bro's a dummy. Or say, describe it. That's better. Say, describe it. He's taking so long to respond. I wish there was a way to know when he's talking to me. Well, do you have your notifications on? What? Ten years ago, there lived a little girl who does Ewa Ewa. Here's your school bag, sweetie. My ear, did she ever be quiet? But she did the Ewa Ewa so much that... Sweetie, now that you're six, <laughs> you'll be given one emotion that you're allowed to express. I was given sadness. Mommy, what will happen if I express a different emotion than the one I'm given? You'll die. Oh, dang it. Happy, happy. My emotion's happy. I'm so happy right now. Hi. <laughs> Mommy, my mouth is hurting from smiling so much. I don't know if I'll be able to sleep tonight. <laughs> it's not going to be easy. Your eyes are watering. Are you crying? No, no, no. My eyes are watering because of joy. Tears of joy. I'm so happy right now. Try thinking of ponies and rainbows. That way you'll fall asleep happily. Ponies and rainbows. Ponies and rainbows. How did you sleep? Great, Mom. I was just thinking of the usual ponies and rainbows. That always cheers me up. I love you, sweetie. Mom, why are you smiling? That's not your assigned emotion. Are you smiling? Get ready with me, but first, I'm so tired, so I'm gonna drink coffee out of my Stanley. Mmm, delicious. Sweetie, that Stanley's empty, and you didn't even take a real sip. Also, you're not old enough to drink coffee. You need to be as old as me to drink coffee. Yeah, you're old, all right. First, wrinkle cream. Don't you think you're a little too young to be using wrinkle cream, sweetie? Mom, I'm like nine and a half. I could start getting wrinkles at any moment now. Ugh. Mom, why is it tingling? Is it supposed to do that? Maybe that just means
means the skincare is working. Okay, everyone, now I'm going to use the Viber Whip Sunscreen. You shouldn't put food on your face, sweetie. It's sunscreen. <laughs> I don't want to get sun damage or wrinkles. And based on the looks of your face, you haven't used sunscreen a day in your life. <laughs> sweetie, I bought you real whipped cream, not the sunscreen one. <laughs> Australian from Australia. I'm from Australia, by the way. You're not Australian. That's not how they sound. I am, mate. No, you're not. I am. Where'd your accent go? All right, you left me no choice. I'm gonna gaslight. My whole family is dead. My mother, my brother, my father. Your mom's still alive. She's active on Facebook. Last night, your mom posted a photo of your entire family together. You're a liar. Huh? It was actually yesterday morning she posted on Facebook, not last night. Liar! You guys, you know what is so crazy? I'm 104 years old, but I keep getting mistaken for a newborn baby. <laughs> Who is she talking to? The other day I went into the cafeteria, no makeup, no filter, just rolled out of bed and I got asked, um, are you 17 years old? What are you doing here? I said, no, no, I'm not 17. And then they said, you must be one of the staff then. Get back to work. She's delusional. <laughs> she hasn't been taking her meds. When I first got admitted into the nursing home, I pulled up and they asked, um, are you old enough to be in here? <laughs> no, Miss Applewood. What we said is, aren't you too old to be in here? Shut She gave me her infinite time. I, I have to find her. Wait. Where did she go? She couldn't have gone that far. Brianna, don't you understand? She gave you all her time, meaning she's gone for good. I'm going to live forever. I'm going to give you at least a couple hundred years, you know, so I'm not so lonely. Living for all eternity. Error. That's weird. Error. It won't let me. Either I give you my infinite years or nothing. I'm going to be all alone. <laughs> Why are you crying? Are you okay? My time left is only two days. It's going to be okay. You're not going anywhere. No, you don't understand. It's over for me. I've already been lent so much time. What are you doing? Goodbye. The red rose or the black rose? I want the black rose. It's black like my soul. No, honey, what have you done? What have I done? The red rose is the rose of life. The black rose is the rose of death. Everyone will be scared to love you. Because if someone breaks your heart, they'll die. Hey, Brianna's kind of cute. Look at her face. She has the black rose. If you break her heart, you'll die. Oh no, I better stay away from her. Now, why is a pretty girl like you sitting all by herself? They're afraid of me because I chose the black rose. If they break my heart, they'll die. Ah, get away from me. Now, why is a pretty girl like you standing in the hallway all by herself? I don't know. Come here. Jake, you did it. Oh, this is going to be easy. Good morning, Mom. Good morning, sweetheart. Here, I made you lunch. You always know just how to brighten someone's day. <laughs> hey, Mrs. K, that necklace looks absolutely stunning on you. Really? It does? My bully? No way. She doesn't deserve it. What are you wearing? <laughs> I know, it's so funny, right? I mean, like, what am I wearing? What am I wearing? You're acting strange. Hey, want to know something so crazy? I've never actually seen you smile. Why don't you show me those pearly whites? <laughs> okay. Hey, so I'm actually doing a survey for a class. I just need you to write down all the things that make you happy. I know what you're doing. I'm trying to make me smile. It's not going to work. I haven't smiled one day in my entire life. It's time to see my mark. <gasps> Multicolor? But that doesn't even exist. I need to cover this. It could mean something really bad. I got pink, meaning I'm going to be unsuccessful in life. Wait, where's your mark? It's, it's crazy. I didn't get one. That's weird. Come on, let's go for our mark check. Our what? Hi, so as you can see, I don't have any mark. There must be some kind of mistake, some kind of mix-up. I can see the mark underneath your makeup. Take off your makeup and come back. What does it mean? Multicolor? I don't know. It it doesn't even exist. You're lucky your mark has no meaning. Mine is doomed me to an unsuccessful life. I know. It's not fair. You deserve a purple mark. 
rich and famous and... <gasps> oh my goodness. You have two options. Either I banish you from society for all eternity. No. Or we change your assigned color to white. You can do that? Yes, but you must always fit the mold. Always kind, never dangerous. Failure to do so, you will be banished. No second chances. Hey, leave her alone, jerk. Jake? Maria? Look over there. It's a distraction. Run! Do you really want to live this way? A social reject? An embarrassment to your family? Brianna, don't listen to him. We'll tell everyone that we made a mistake. That you were always meant to be assigned white. Brianna, no! I'm sorry. It's the only option. I have to go with him. I knew it. You were always meant to be assigned white. What was it like, hanging out with those horrifying reds? They're literally insane. Don't talk that way about my friends. I can't believe it. I can't believe my soulmate is a killer. Calm down. Just breathe. You'll probably never even have to meet him. You know, it's honestly offensive that the universe thinks I belong with somebody like that. Let's get our mind off things. Let's watch TV. Breaking news. The Cheerios Bandit is on the loose. What kind of name is that? The Cheerios Bandit? He already has over ten bodies. Could that be him? Your soulmate? I, I need some fresh air. I think I'm gonna throw up. There's no way. There's no way the Cheerios Bandit could be my soulmate. Who are you? Come with me. Stop posting thirst traps on TikTok. Very bold of you to say. Oh, would you look at that? Four million one hundred thousand? Four million two hundred thousand. Wow, your crushes are going very fast. Cut it out already. Who are you to tell me what to do? We broke up, right? This is getting out of hand. Just stop posting. I'll stop posting when you stop. Hey. Look, I don't want your critique any longer. I'm here to say I'm sorry. I get it. I understand how you're feeling. It's hard to see people fall for the person you like. It's my fault, too. I was being insecure. You know what I think of this whole crush soulmate thing? You covered my crushes. Yeah, let's not look at them anymore. They don't define our relationship. You're right. I like it better. Why do you have so many crushes all of a sudden? I do? Really? How many? Two hundred. Two hundred? Nice. How was that nice? Says the guy with over four million simps. How did you do it? I, uh, started TikTok. Let me see. No, no, don't. Seriously? You're posting thirst traps? Two thousand crushes, really? I have two thousand crushes already? I can't believe I ever even liked you. How can you even be upset? You have way more crushes than I do. Yeah, but I didn't purposely get people to crush on me just to spite you. Look, I'm sorry. I was just jealous, and I thought if I had lots of crushes too, we could be equal. Save it, all right? I'm leaving. Have fun with your simps. Yeah, and you have fun with yours. So beautiful, just as I expected. <laughs> I mean, you too. You're, you're handsome, I mean, not beautiful. Well, you are beautiful, but... <laughs> I get what you mean. Well, you better get home and rest. Our wedding's tomorrow. Yeah, you're right. I now pronounce you Prince and Prince. Wait, she's a liar. Emily? Who's that? That's Emily. She's my best friend. Her mark is fake. She's not the real princess. I am. But Emily, your mark was gold. I covered it because I was scared of being royalty. But I can't sit back and watch you lie any longer. Is, is this true? I... Both of you are coming with me till we figure this out. No! If you're happy and you know it, push someone down the stairs. Hello, Brianna. Principal Stevens, you can go down the stairs first. How kind of you. Principal Stevens? Principal Stevens? I think I killed him. If you're happy and you know it, say hooray. Hooray! Are you okay? You look worried. My boyfriend is not going to be happy with me. I killed his dad. Principal Stevens? How could you? You killed my dad? Babe, wait. Please just listen to me. I didn't have a choice. I got happy you know it to push someone down the stairs. I didn't know he'd die. Why would you choose my dad? If you're happy and you know it, break up with your boyfriend. Babe, we have to break up. 
You just got a happy and you know it, didn't you? That's funny. I just got one to kill you. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. Whoa, Brianna looks hot. Hey, girl, come sit with us. Yesterday, when you said I couldn't sit with you guys, you made me lose a heart. I can't trust you guys won't break my heart again. You never even deserved it in the first place. <laughs> babe, you look so good today. I'm not your babe. Yesterday, you didn't want to be with me because I had pimples. You made me lose a heart. I only have one left because of you. I can't trust you won't break my heart again. I'm sorry. Class, we have a new student today. Everyone meet John. You can sit wherever you like, John. Hey, can I sit here? Sure. Do whatever you want. Lucky me. I get to sit next to the prettiest girl in the class. Look, I'm not interested. I can't risk getting involved with another person again. Hey, wait. Why did you say you can't risk getting involved with another person? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left, too. How about we take the risk together? Do this. Don't. Breathe. <gasps> I'm asthmatic. I need my inhaler. Do that. Breathe. Do this. Breathe. <sighs> Thank goodness you let us breathe. I was about to pass out. I need to use the washroom. Hurry before she tells us to do something. Do this. Stand still. Guess you can't use the bathroom. I already did. I'm so hungry. Can this game stop so I can eat something? Do this. Pick up a slice of pizza. Mmm, pizza. No, she didn't say to eat it. Please let us eat the pizza. I'm so hungry. If I don't eat something soon, I'm going to pass out. Do this. Finish the slice of pizza before the timer runs out. Listen to everything the dad tells you to do or listen to everything your mom tells you to do. I don't want to listen to my mom. Bye, mom. Bye, sissy. Trip your little sister. <laughs> yes, tripper, tripper. No, I don't want to do that. Then you can become one of us. Yes, become dead like us. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll do it. Just stop. Stop, please. Tripper. Come on, tripper. Hey, sissy. Yeah? Owie. <laughs> All right, class. It's time to write your exam. Don't write your exam. <laughs> Pick up your pen and throw it right at the teacher's eye. No, I won't do it. Okay, I'll do it. Throw it right at her eye. Bullseye. Are you serious? Why am I the one always getting calls? Brianna, you need to answer it. No, this isn't fair. Hurry. Answer now or die. Your word? Anti-disestablishmentarianism. anti anti dis dis Disestablishment. Pass on your word. Give me a minute! Brianna, hurry, pass the word on to me. I can't. It's too hard. Teacher? Teacher, I have to pass a word on to you. Anti-disestablishmentarianism. Easy word. You know I'm an English teacher, right? Jake, come here. Anti-disestablishment. <laughs> I'm getting a call. Me. Truth? Or dare? Um, truth! Timmy, are you interested in women or men? Timmy, tell the truth, because if you lie, you'll die. Women! I'm interested in women, obviously. Why would I like men? Timmy, that was a lie. Babe, are you doing okay? I know you and Timmy were close. Yeah, I'll be okay. Brianna, truth or dare? Truth! Truth is easy. Do you really love your boyfriend? If not, who do you really love? Babe, you got an easy one. Of course you love me. No. I'm in love with your brother. She's telling the truth. How could you? How could you be in love with my brother? I'm sorry. Derek, truth or dare? Truth, obviously. You must pick dare. Fine, dare. Kill Brianna. Mother, may I comfort my friend? No, you may not. You may kill her with the item in your back pocket. No, Brianna, you wouldn't. I'm your friend. Steph, I can't disobey Mother. Ah! Steph, there's nowhere for you to run now. Mother, may I kill Brianna? 
You may. No! Mother, may I go home and cry? No, you may not. You may face the consequences of your actions. Look what you did! You killed Steph! How could you, Brianna? She was my best friend! She was my friend, too! Mother told me to do it. I can't disobey what Mother says. Mother, may I avenge my friend and kill Brianna? You may. No, wait! Mother, may I ask for a truce? You? Mommy, look what I can do! And what, and what, and what, and what? Mommy! No, sissy, you just killed mom. Were you dancing? I was just doing this. And what, and Stop! What, and dancing what, kills what. people! <gasps> oh no. Sissy! Did you hear? She killed her mom and sister when she was six years old. Can people stop bringing that up? I was six. I didn't know dancing killed people. Everybody knows dancing kills people. It's the first thing we learn when we're younger. Whatever. Oh look, it's the family killer. That's it. I can't take this anymore. I'm going home. Brianna, leaving school early? Going home to kill more family members? Be quiet. Come on, show us. Show us the dance moves you use to kill your family. No, she's actually dancing. Let's get out of here. Brianna, what did you do? Brianna, did you take my blush? Wait, before you speak, I want you to know how important it is for you to never lie. Because when you lie, you'll forget all memory of the person you lied to. Okay, I took it. I'll be back, sweetie. I'm just going to get some milk. Okay, Daddy. But, little girl, what are you doing in my house? Go back to your own house. You don't remember me? Daddy lied. Okay. I'll go back to my own house. All right, Mom, I'm heading to school. Listen, just hurry up and send the child support. I need it. Who are you talking to? Your father. Father? But I don't have a dad. I've never had a dad. Fine. Don't tell me then. Class, I'd like you to meet our new principal, Principal Stevens. Brianna, it's so nice to finally meet you. Brianna, I don't want to be the one to tell you this, but that is not your mom. I am your real mother. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She doesn't even know me. You're right. You think you know my own mother better than I do? You're just never happy for me. Brianna, wait. Ella's mom, what are you doing here? Ella never came home from school yesterday. Since you're her best friend, I thought you might know where she went. I don't. I'm sorry. Jake, we have to cancel our date tonight. My best friend's missing. I'm really worried about her. That's no problem. Get some rest. You've been talking to Jake a lot recently. Yeah, I really like him. Honey, hurry downstairs. I have a surprise for you. Surprise! Ella? Jake? I don't think they're breathing. Since you like them so much, I brought them to you. Let's play a game. Selected. Why would you do that? One of us is going to die now. Yes, but one of us is going to get money. What game are we playing? A game of odds. Heads or tails? Tails. All right, I choose heads then. No, it's tails. Uh, a redo? Just the granola bar? Yes, how much? Let's play a game. Selected. What game? Go fish. The ten of hearts? Go fish. <sighs> Joker. What? How did you know? You're a cheater! Mom, I'm home. Sissy, let's play a game. Selected. No, you can't say those words. Okay, class, it's time to complete the assignment in front of you. You may work in small groups. Brittany. Brittany! Ah, what is it? I was sleeping! My soulmate is in this classroom! No way! Cover your ear and listen closely. See if you can find any hints where he might be. Good idea. I hear a gum wrapper. No, no, it's paper moving. Well, any idea who it might be? The sound stopped. Foot tapping. Whoever's tapping their foot is my soulmate. Oh, come on! Why'd you stop tapping your foot? Brianna, don't disrupt my class again. Sorry, sir. I'm sorry. Watch where you're going. Brittany? Brittany! Brianna, wait. I don't know if you know me, but... I don't know you. 
I can't find her. Mom, when can I finally transfer schools? Soon, don't worry, it will be better there. That voice! Brianna, wait, I don't know if you know me, but- I don't know you! He was my soulmate. Brianna looks like she's seen a ghost. <laughs> now, Brittany, making fun of someone is not a very nice thing to do. Apologize or face the consequences. The substitute teacher is the controller of right or wrong. What? Anyways, I guess I need to apologize. I'm so sorry that you're so easy to make fun of. Brittany, no, that's not an apology. Fine, I'm so sorry your face looks so silly when you're scared. No! Brittany! You're not going anywhere. You've got a lot of learning to do. Mmm, cookie. Can I see? Sure. Give me that. Timmy, give me my cookie back. Timmy, stealing someone's food without permission is not right. Make it right or die. Ah, okay, here. You already took a bite out of it. Hold out your hand. I can give it back. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. You keep it. Hello? Sissy, the control of right or wrong is in my classroom. Brianna's using her phone in class. Timmy! I love stealing Big Sissy's makeup. It's so much fun. Brianna, you did something wrong. You stole your Big Sister's makeup. Now you must make things right. You must right your wrong before the timer runs out or else you die. Live or die, the choice is up to you. Big Sissy! Big Sissy, Big Sissy! What's wrong? I'm sorry I stole your lipstick and I put it all over my face. It was a mistake and I really hope you forgive me. <laughs> I can't believe you took my lipstick again. What's wrong with you? You're such a little brat. Wait, don't worry about it, okay? I forgive you. I love you. I love you, sissy. Mommy, when's dinner ready? I cheated! I cheated on you! I'm so sorry! I didn't mean to! What? Ah, daddy! Cover your eyes! <laughs> this is all your guys' fault! You kids are so bad, you wouldn't have found another woman! Or maybe you're just a terrible wife! Don't you? Guys, stop fighting! I just got a timer over my head. So did I. Anna, let's play dolls. I can't, Sophie. I'm too tired. They only let us sleep one hour within 24 hours. I know. I'm so tired, too. I could fall asleep right now. Oh. Sophie, no. Sophie. <laughs> Sophie, you can't fall asleep. <laughs> Sophie, no. Go to sleep. Wake up. Wake up. Five more minutes. I'm awake. I'm awake. Hey, Timmy, do you think they'll let us sleep eight hours anytime soon? I don't know. They haven't let us sleep all week. Class, you may have noticed they've been cutting back sleeping hours significantly. That is because they're trying to eliminate as many people as possible. Only those that can stay awake will survive. No! This isn't fair! They can't do this, right, Timmy? Oh, Timmy? I'm gonna fall asleep. Timmy! Out your gad. This is such a classic. For the Rizzler, you're so skibbity. You're so phantom tag. Someone please mute her mic. It's saying please remove card. What am I supposed to do? You're supposed to remove your card, ma'am. Gosh darn it! This technology computer things are so difficult to understand! Good morning. Mom, I have like 10 sweaters on. Why is the house freezing cold? The government released a temperature meter to help you find your soulmate. The hotter it is, the closer you are to your soulmate, and the colder it is, the farther away you are from your soulmate. Where is my soulmate? The moon? It's finally starting to warm up a bit. Not for me. Burr. I'm even colder than I was this morning. I feel heat coming from that way. You should follow it then. It will lead you to your soulmate. I need to go towards the heat. I've been freezing all morning long. It's getting warmer. Follow the heat. What are you doing? I'm following the heat. Oh, it's getting hot. This door, it's like it's on fire. That's where my soulmate must be. Oh my gosh. Why is it so hot in here? Excuse me, are you in the right classroom? I'm going to school now, mom. Wait, sweetie, you almost forgot your lunch. Thanks. Mom, your last kiss was Mr. Stevens? What about dad? I'm sorry, sweetie. I know he's your principal. Please don't tell your father. Please. Bree, guess what? Sophie. No way. You had your first kiss? And it was Chad? Why didn't you tell me? I was going to. Wow, would you look at that? Your last kiss was Jake. Obviously, he is your boyfriend. Brianna, wait. Oh, hey, Chad. 
You look so beautiful today. I need to tell you, I've been in love with you since the second grade. Chad, you're Jake's best friend, and Sophie... You got something on the corner of your mouth. Let me get it for you. Okay. Chad, why did you just kiss me? I'm sorry, I... Now no one can touch me or they'll know we kissed! Bree! Are you running late to class, too? Hold my hand, babe. Let's work together. Stay back! Mommy, why whenever I hold onto an object, it says send to soulmate? That's because, honey, any object you touch, you can send to your soulmate. And he can send you any object he touches. I'm going to send him Mr. Octopus. <gasps> Mommy, my soulmate wants to send me something. What did he do to my octopus? And why is there a puzzle piece with an H on it? Oh, honey. I'm never letting my soulmate send me anything ever again. And I'm never sending him anything. My soulmate sent me flowers. Oh, that's so sweet. Did your soulmate send you anything today? No, I haven't accepted anything from my soulmate since I was six. You should accept it. It might be something important. Yeah. A puzzle piece with an E on it. Oh, my soulmate's trying to send me something again. LP? He sent me E earlier. Maybe he's trying to say something? Yeah, like Lep or L. Pal? And why is there a puzzle piece with an H on it? Help! Whoa, you all right there, Timmy? You're lucky I was there to save you. You saved me. I love you. <laughs> I love you too, Timmy. We live, we love, we lie. Timmy, what are you seeing? That sounds terrible. Gibbity skibbity. Oh no, Timmy caught the mean disease. You have to keep your ears covered and get out of there. What are you saying? I can't hear you. Oh, I got him. We live. <laughs> Come on. Memes are a very infectious disease. If you hear someone saying meme sounds, you must plug your ears and get out of there immediately, or else you could be infected forever. Hey, babe. Today, it's officially been 10 years since my brother Timmy died because of the meme disease. <laughs> it's been 10 years already? Huh? I said it's been 10 years already? Huh? I said it's been 10 years already? Huh? Huh? Oh, no. You caught the meme disease. Huh? Seriously, only 10 lives today? I'm not going to have enough money to buy anything. Sweetie, wait. You must remember to never overspend your lives because if you spend more lives than you have, you'll die. Of course, Mom. I already know that. Hey, girl. Hey. How many lives did you get today? I only got 10 today. Well, you still got more than me. I only have one life. No way. You're broke. I know. It's so unfair. Look at Timmy over there. He gets millions of lives every single day. He's so rich. How is it even possible? I'd like to buy this, please. That'll cost you nine lives. Are you serious? Why does it cost so much? Don't blame me. Blame inflation. Do you still want it or not? Okay, fine. I'll take it. I'm starving. <sighs> oh, my bad. It actually cost 10 lives. I need one more life. What? I got 110 happiness today. I'm so happy. Maybe a little too much. How much did you get? 1%. That's even more than yesterday. Darn it. That's so sad. It's going to be my life goal from now on to get you more happiness. What makes you happy? Pain and suffering. No. I'd like to buy this granola bar. That'll be 3% happiness. Dang it. I don't have enough. I really need to get more happiness. Well, that's too bad. Why is there a bunch of men over there with six packs? Where? Hey, you need to pay for that! Hey, Brittany, you said you'd help me get more happiness. I'm down. I'm tired of being broke. Yay! I'm so excited! Brianna, I figured out what will make you more happy. If you got a boyfriend, I found a man who's willing to go on a date with you. Hi, I'm Timmy. <laughs> what? 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 What the? Brianna, no, you're supposed to flirt with Timmy. I was flirting. Steve? Steve, wait! Stinky, wait! I mean, Steve! That's it! Never talk to me again! I have a lot of people I need to apologize to, don't I? Boyfriend number one and boyfriend number two. I'm here to apologize to you guys and give back the Christmas gifts you gave to me. We have names, you know? It's the right thing to do, so... Okay, let go! Let go! You're forgiven, by the way. Honestly, we couldn't care less about you. We should actually be thanking you. Thanking me? Why? Because if it wasn't for you, we never would have met each other. Him and I are together now. We're in love. Brittany, I'm sorry I chopped off your hair earlier in class. I was just jealous because Jake complimented you and not me. You can have it back if you want. Why would you keep it? I was going to keep it in a jar in case I ever needed to clone you. What the? Prince 
Principal Stevens, I need to make an announcement. No, you're not making an Attention everyone, this announcement is for Steve. I... What needs to say to you, Happy Halloween before the timer runs out, or else also I stole all your candy. Yo, mother! Um, excuse me, miss, on Halloween day, what do people usually say to each other? Sweetie, why are you out all by yourself? Just hurry up and answer my question! Happy Halloween? Yes, you got it. Thank you. Give me back my candy, mister. No. <laughs> Twick or tweet, smell my feet, give me something good to eat. If you don't, I won't be sad. I'll just make you wish you had. Okay, okay, here. <laughs> it's Halloween night now, Mom. I love you. Stay safe out there. How long are they going to make us trick or treat till? By wall, you must trick or treat until you're 30. I love you. I'll see you tonight. Yeah. Ready for the first house of the night? Mm hmm. Happy Halloween! Trick, Trick or, or treat. treat! Babe, I got a treat! Here's your treat! I got a trick! Here's a tricky riddle for you. Some people are afraid of me. When you see me, you see less. What am I? Answer before the timer runs out! Brianna! What rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. <laughs> mommy! Emily, stop crying! I'm trying to think! I want mommy! Mommy's gone, okay? She's gone and she's never coming back! Brother! Correct! <laughs> hey, Emily, I'm sorry I acted that way. I'll walk myself to school today. Don't follow me. Emily! Bree, you good? My mom couldn't rhyme the word this morning, and my sister won't even talk to me. So yeah, I'm not doing great. Brianna, what rhymes with sister? Miss her. Correct. Man, that's tough. Here, do my assignment for me. Brittany, what rhymes with assignment? Nothing rhymes with assignment because assignment isn't even a real word. Assignment is most definitely a real word. Assignment? Hmm. Come on, Brittany, use your brain. I don't need to use my brain because I'm pretty. Pretty. Brianna, something happened to your sister. Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Hey, mind if I sit here? Hi, Jimmy. <laughs> Brie, your voice sounded so weird. I know. Um. Sophie, Jimmy is my soulmate. Really? How do you know? Well, my soulmate's name has five letters. Jimmy's name has five letters. Also, it starts with a J. Jimmy's name starts with a J. No way. Jimmy's your soulmate for sure then. Jimmy's over there. Go get your man, girl. Jimmy! I mean... Hi, Jimmy. Oh, hey, Brianna. Is everything okay? What's up? I think you're really cute, and I was wondering if I could get your number. Brianna, what are you doing trying to get my boyfriend's number? Boyfriend? Jimmy and I are together. We're dating. Well, that's too darn bad, Timmy. Break up! Jimmy's my soulmate, so we're getting married. But I don't even like women. Are you sure Jimmy's your soulmate? My soulmate's name is Jimmy. <laughs> I guess we need to break up, Pookie. Either way, that means your soulmate is in the school. He's probably wherever Jake is. Jake! Jake! What is it, Brianna? Why are you calling me? Jake, who were you just talking to a minute ago? My boy Chad here. Sup? No, who did you steal lunch money from? How am I supposed to remember that? I steal a lot of people's lunch money. It's true, he does. You're no help, Jake! Hi, Jakey! <laughs> Brittany, let's go! <laughs> What's wrong? My soulmate's crying. Mom, can you come pick me up? I'm scared! He wants to go home. If he goes home, that means I'm not going to be able to find him today. You'll find him soon. At least you know he goes to the school. Boring, boring stuff. Math, geometry, numbers, equations, multiplication, division. Is my soulmate in this classroom? I don't get it, Stephanie. I've been alive 17 years and no one's ever had a crush on me. If I don't get a crush within the next year, I'll be dead. Let me tell you a little secret about how I got all my crushes, Brianna. Mewing. Mew? Like the Pokemon? No, like model face. Just press your tongue to the roof of your mouth, and there's your model face. Whoa! Did it work? You're going to get so many crushes for sure. Jake's over there! Go now! Go! Okay! Hi, Jake! Gross! Brianna, what are you doing here? Get out of here now! Right, mewing. Oh my, you are the love of my life. Give me your number right now, Brianna. <laughs> no! Dude, dude, man. Ah, hey, boys. Please go away. Whoa, Brianna, you seem different today. 
Seth, the mewing has been working great. I got so many new crushes. What you bring for lunch? I got- You can't sit at our table. We don't allow pick -me's here. Jason was Stephanie's crush and you flirted with him. Steph? Ah, uh, ah, uh, really get into it. Yeah. Sophie, stop dancing. Yeah, yeah. Sophie! Yeah, yeah. I can't. I'm sorry. I can't stop dancing. Sophie. In March and, and three days. Eugene, stop singing. Why? Because you're singing junk cook. You're going to make everyone in this classroom dance. In March and, and three days. Everyone, plug your ears. You won't regret me. Won't regret me. That's it. I can't do it anymore. I'm dancing. And three days. Yay, dance is not banned anymore. No. That trash bag is so cute. Thank you. I call it garbage chic. You should try it, Emma, because I can see everything. Not everything. I'm still wearing socks. No, Emma, you can't wear socks. Oh, thank goodness. No. We want to be free. Speak for yourself, Chad. Huh? Please don't break up with me, Pookie. I'm sorry. It needs to be done. <laughs> Sophie, Jimmy's not my soulmate. Oh, that's too bad. What are you going to do now? What I need to do is I need to sneak in the principal's office and get a list of all of the J names in the school. That's not going to work. You don't even know if he goes to this school. The only for sure way to find your soulmate is correctly guess his name. The second letter of my soulmate's name is... Bree, which letter are you going to guess? I don't know. No, no, no. I didn't mean to guess that. Try again. Okay. The second letter of my soulmate's name is... Oh, I just wasted two of my guesses. Guess again, but be extra careful this time. The second letter of my soulmate's name is Q. Why would you choose Q? What's wrong with you? Choose a common letter. Okay, okay. The second letter of my soulmate's name is A. It's J-A. What could the third be? You're Brianna. What's up? Oh, hey, James. I am just so disgusted right now. That I would just barge in on you two like that. Baby, next time you have a friend over, let me know, okay? So this won't happen again. All right, I'll let you two have your fun. I'm going to go do some shopping on Rodeo Drive. Text me if you need anything. Food, water, another woman. Great. Oh, and baby, the private jet for Bora, Bora is coming tomorrow at 8 a.m., right? Yay, I can't wait. Love ya. Timmy, let's play. Mother, may I play with Timmy? You may. Yay! Okay, let's throw our stuffed animals at each other. Timmy, you need to ask, Mother, may I? Why do I need to ask too? She already said you could play with me. You still need to ask. No, I don't! <gasps> Timmy, Timmy, you did in fact need to ask, Mother, may I? Mother, may I say Timmy no? You may. Mother, may I go to school? You may, but you must get there within five minutes. Ah! <sighs> Mother, may I go to class? You may not. You may stand there. Babe, let's walk to class together. I can't. Mother won't let me. Why not? She's such a... Shh! You may not talk badly about Mother. Mommy, can I have a lollipop? No, sweetie. No sweets for you. Honey, stop pouting. You need to smile right now. It's the new beauty standard. You need to or else bye-bye from Earth. Good job. Keep smiling. Mommy, can I stop smiling now? My mouth is hurting from smiling so much. That's too bad. You still need to keep smiling. Why do I even need to fit the beauty standard? I'm only a kid. Use your hands and turn that frown upside down. <gasps> oh, no. I need to get big lips right away. I already have big lips. There. Beautiful. Wow, your lips look so big. Are you kidding me? There. No lips. Sophie, why do you still have big lips? What? The beauty standard changed. Someone doesn't fit the beauty standard. Today I'm going to do a physical demonstration on how fast January goes by versus how fast February goes by. Let's start with January. I'm January. I'm going by so, so slowly. Moving so slow. Okay, and now February. Meow. Why would you cook a frying pan in the oven? Oh no, the whole house is burning down. <laughs> Hurry up, go get the fire extinguisher on the roof. Why would the fire extinguisher be on the roof? Wait. Am 
I still dreaming? Is this a dream? Dream? What are you talking about? You're awake. What's your middle name? My name is Mom. What day of the week is it? Today's day? It's today. This is still a dream. If it was a dream, gonna do this? <gasps> am I awake now or am I still dreaming? Oh no, I think this is still a dream. Maybe if I go to sleep in my dream, I'll wake up in real life. <gasps> is everything all right? Yeah, I just, I had a dream that I was falling. Jake, what are you doing in my house? I've come to profess my love for you. I love you, Bree. Aww. Stay back. Jake is my man. What the f- There will be one more intuition test. Whoever passes, survives. The mug in front of you is either full or empty. Using your intuition, you must decide which one it is. Whoever figures it out will survive. Using my intuition, I say that this cup is empty. You passed. Yay! The cup in front of me, ouch, that's some hot coffee. It's full. No, Timmy, you have to find out using your intuition. Oopsie. <laughs> Timmy, no! no yelling in the classroom. Sorry, Mrs. Smith. Come on, little sissy, let's go to school. What? Otter? Oh no. Sissy, we have to finish the word together using our intuition. Okay, and I can say anything. Maybe I'll say water snake. No, you can't! I mean, sorry for yelling at you. You need to finish the word with what you think I would say. How I would finish the word. Okay? Okay, I'm ready. Three, two. You're gonna wish you had dated me because no one wants to be seen with someone who's worthless like you. Ew, the worthless girl's in our classroom. Ew, get her out of here. I'm worth a million dollars, but I can feel my worth decreasing with her just sitting there. Why is everyone saying Brianna's worthless? She's not. She's priceless. They put a zero because they can't put a dollar amount on someone who's priceless. She has the highest amount of worth there is. You're all very lucky to be in the same classroom with her because there's very few people in this world who are priceless like her. No way, it's the priceless girl. Take photos of her. She's the highest worth. You know you should be thanking me, Brianna. Thanking you? Yeah, if I didn't share the photo of your price tag to the whole school, you would have always thought you're just worthless. I know my worth, Timmy, and I don't need some tag to tell me. Brianna. Jake. I can't believe you're priceless. That's amazing. I mean, before, when I thought you were worthless, I would have never wanted to date you, but now I'd like to take you out on a date. Jake, I... Dancing or singing? Well, I like singing, so he must also like singing, so I'll choose dancing. No! Brianna, everything will be okay. No, Timmy, it's not going to be okay. I have one more question left, and if I answer it right, I'm going to be dead, just like my soulmate. What is it? What's the question? Your soulmate has met you before? Obviously, I've never met my soulmate, so... I'll choose yes? No. No, I've met my soulmate before, but when? When would I have met him? Ah! 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 Am I dead? Well, I'm at a graveyard. R.I.P. Timmy. <laughs> That's funny, I know a Timmy. Yeah, you do. It's me. Timmy, that can't be you. You're alive. You're right in front of me. I was allowed to appear in front of you and only you until you found out I'm your soulmate. But I'm not alive. I'm just a soul. Timmy, no! It's this video right here. Look. <gasps> What are you doing? <laughs> I purposely bumped into you. Ha 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 ha. No, no, that's not what happened. They edited it to make me look bad and twisted the whole situation. Plus, it was an accident. Are you yelling at me right now? Guys, she's yelling at me. Absolutely despicable. No, 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 I wasn't yelling at you, Sophie. Is everything okay here? She's so scary. Are you gonna cry? No, I'm not going to cry. I just have something in my eye, and I need to go to the bathroom to get it out. I can't believe she yelled at me. Brianna! Everything's going to be okay. My rating was at almost a five, and now it's at a three, but that's okay. It's okay! I can make it go back up. How am I going to make it go back up? An apology video. Okay, make it look like I'm crying. Perfect. Let's practice. I'm so, so sorry. Perfect. I'm Will you be my girlfriend? Can you ask me again in two hours? Why should I ask you again in two hours? <laughs> I'm kind of dating someone right now, but don't worry, I don't even like them. That sounds really bad. Look, the thing is, I'm trying to find my soulmate, so I'm trying to date as many people as possible, and... It's okay. I totally get it. Everyone's trying to find their soulmate. I'll see you in two hours, Brianna. Okay. I'll see you in two hours, then.
Bye, Kevin. See you soon. Mmm, sandwich. No, no, please. Don't eat me. Oh, no. It's time. Why'd you throw your lunch on the floor? I have to go break up with Eugene. Eugene? Eugene? Eugene, where is that nerd? I can just break up with him over text. We are breaking up. Goodbye, loser. Uh, I can't believe you broke up with me over text. Eugene, if we didn't break up before the timer ran out and our relationship expired, we would both expire. You didn't have to be so harsh. <laughs> Kevin, I'm single now. Well, then I guess it's time to ask you. Will you be my girlfriend? I...